All right, so I have the AYN Odin 2 here, and I want to show you guys um, a quick tutorial when it comes on to mapping your buttons to your games. So, for example, your Android games, if you want to play a game that doesn't have controller support, there is a software built into the system that you can use to map your controls, but to me, it wasn't as clear um, before. So, I'm just making this video just in case if anyone else is experiencing the same issue as me you know what to do. So I'm going to use um, PUBG as an example because that's the game that I was having an issue with. I wanted to play it but um, I couldn't get this right analog stick to work properly. So I'm going to show you how I map the controls for it to work as how it should. Um, if you have an AY and Odin 2 and you're interested in Android games this might be a very important step for you. Let me just go ahead and turn that down a bit. Yeah, this might be a very important step for you um, when it comes on to playing your Android games such as like Genshin Impact. Um, Call of Duty Mobile already has controller support, so probably not for that, but for, you know, for other stuff. Alright, so we got to go into settings so we can see the on-screen um, button options. I'm going to go to customize. So here you can see all my, my, my controls. Um, I turned the opacity down because I didn't want to see them on screen. I already mapped everything, so I'm going to swipe out and go to Key Adapter. And you can see this is my layout for my, my, my buttons, all my buttons. So this is the right analog stick. I'm going to tap on that. Now, by default, it's going to be set to this, Virtual Joystick Mode. You don't want it on this. You need to set it to adjust view mode, and this will um, give you the option to to move um, around in your game. If you have it on this, which is virtual joystick mode by default, it's not going to move properly. You're not going to be able to pan the camera around, and you won't be able to look around the world while playing um, PUBG and other um, open world games on Android. Directional mode, that doesn't work either. So you need to keep it on adjust view mode. And then we're gonna save. So now we're gonna save it and we're going to jump into a quick match just to test um, PUBG. So let's exit out of this and let's go to and start a, a quick match. Now this is gonna take some more uh, some time, so just get back to this once we're in the match. Alright, so now we're in the lobby of a game and you can see I can move around as normal. So I'm gonna yeah, put on back this key adapter and I'm going to change it to let's set it to directional uh, mode and then save. You can see it's it's not moving. It's not moving the camera around. This is not what we want. And if we set it to um uh, and set it to virtual um, joystick mode. We're gonna jump out of the plane now. So let's wait for that. Ah, let's wait for that and then you, you guys will see. So as you can see, this is not moving properly either. You should be able to pan around the world like. And by default, PUBG, um, the stick for PUBG is it works, but it works very slowly. So I'm gonna jump, and you can see this is what we're getting. We're not getting like a full range of motion. We don't want this. This is unplayable for a game. But by default, if you don't map this stick, let me say, let's say I take this off, and then I save it. It moves, but it's so slow. It's so, so slow. So I'm gonna put it back. So we want the right joystick. Put it right here. Then we're gonna change it back to adjust view mode and save. And that's it. And now we have a full range of motion. This is what it's supposed to be like when you're playing PUBG and other um, open world games. Now this is what you want. Now I hope this video helps. I'll be doing you know additional tutorials on the AY and Odin. So yeah, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a like and share it with a friend who likes tech. And until then, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.